Since 1947, thousands of UFO sightings have been reported across the world. Here are the five most terrifying UFO incidents investigated by the U.S. government. Maury Island, Washington, 1947. Men in Black. On June 28, 1947, Harold Dahl, his son and dog, saw six donut-shaped UFOs over their boat in Puget Sound. Suddenly, the strange craft started raining metallic debris, killing the dog. The next day, Dahl was reportedly visited by a mysterious man in a black suit who somehow knew all the extraordinary details of what Dahl had just experienced. And he had a frightening message. Forget the whole thing, or suffer serious consequences. The reported events of Maury Island have continued to fuel conspiracy theories to this day. Kelly, Kentucky, 1955. Close encounter of the third kind. On the night of August 21, 1955, in the tiny rural town of Kelly, Kentucky, a farm family called the Suttons, reportedly experienced a terrifying siege by otherworldly beings. They lived in an unpainted three-room house without running water, telephone, radio, TV or books. But their story would become one of the most detailed and baffling accounts of an alien close encounter on record. The night of the incident, they arrived breathlessly at the Hopkinsville Police Station in southwestern Kentucky, at about 11 p.m. Police said they were genuinely terror-struck as they told all the details of a UFO landing and the appearance of small alien creatures. Their story is notable for the large number of witnesses and the close proximity between them and the creatures they described. The incident became national news and remains a mystery today. Skinwalker Ranch, Utah, 1980. Cattle Mutilation. For decades, the 500-acre Skinwalker Ranch, in northeastern Utah, has had a reputation as a hotbed of paranormal activity. Owner Terry Sherman and his wife Gwen shared their chilling experiences with a local reporter in June 1996. They claimed to have seen mysterious crop circles and UFOs, and witnessed the systematic and repeated mutilation of their cattle, in an oddly surgical and bloodless manner. Reports still persist of UFOs, and cattle mutilation around the ranch. Terry Sherman got so spooked by the happenings on his new cattle ranch, that 18 months after moving his family to the property, he sold it away, and never looked back. Holloman Air Force Base, New Mexico, 1956. Alien Abduction. This bizarre case reportedly occurred in March, 1956, and involved two military personnel searching the desert for debris from a recent missile launch. One of the men reported seeing the other being pulled up into a flying silver disc. Three days later, the alleged abductee's corpse was found 10 miles away, severely mutilated and completely drained of blood. But the proof of this incident remains thin, as the government report on the incident mysteriously vanished. Keweenaw Point, Michigan, 1953. Alien Abduction. On November 23, 1953, a U.S. Air Force radar picked up an unidentified craft in restricted airspace over Lake Superior. AF 89C Scorpion jet was scrambled to intercept. What followed was one of the strangest cases on record. Once airborne, Lt. Wilson had difficulty tracking the unknown object, which kept changing course. With ground control directing the aviators over the radio, the Scorpion gave chase. The jet, traveling at 500 miles per hour, pursued the object for 30 minutes, gradually closing in until it caught up to the unknown object at an altitude of 8,000 feet. At that point, the two radar blips converged into one, and locked together. Then, according to the official accident report, the F-89 simply disappeared from the radar scope. And then the UFO sped off. Wreckage of the plane was never found, and the Air Force gave conflicting explanations to the pilot's widow. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this content, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe.